Now to the real trees and the artificial trees. Some may call it extra, but glowing up that artificial tree can be a great way to express yourself. Sayla Estill shows us how sentimental these trees can be. If you think putting up one tree is enough, you're wrong. See how this tree enthusiast goes all out for Christmas while putting up decorations that are meaningful. Traditionally, households will hang up one tree. Heather Halliburton holds a collection of 74 trees that are over three feet. For nearly 20 years, she's been going above and beyond when it comes to her decorating game. She tells us about the inspiration behind some of the trees, including breast cancer. It's one of the causes that I really support um, and then wanted to like build that into a tree. Um, I have a Santa Claus tree because I think, you know, Santa is a huge part of Christmas. I love my friends. I have a friendship tree. Um, as a kid, I remember watching Wizard of Oz every year, so I have my Wizard of Oz tree. In September, she begins decorating her trees with ornaments, then gathers various themes coming from different hobbies and interests. She credits Festival of Trees for teaching her different techniques of decorating. That's where she met Kristen McHugh Johnson and this Grinch tree. Heather really added a number of different types of ribbons that just really remind you of the book itself. And I think that we just like the way that it, it came together uh, with the ribbon, with the floral, with all of the ornaments. Her support system contributes a lot to the process. One of the most sentimental trees is one honoring her late father, showcasing ornaments of things he liked, such as lighthouses. In mid-December, she offered an open house where friends and family get to explore the scene, with donations going to local charities. She says there will definitely be over 100 trees next year, and as far as themes, there's more to come. For 25 News, Sayla Estelle.